In this video, we are going to understand working with multiple style sheets in CSS. If some properties have been defined for the same selector or for the same element in different style sheets, the value from the last read style sheet will be used. Next, assume that an external style sheet has the following style for heading 1 like the color is going to be navy. Then assume that an internal style sheet also has the following style for the same H1 heading. That would be the color will be orange. So here in both of the examples, you can see that we are talking about H1 heading. And for both of them, we are using two style sheets. One is internal, one is external. And in both the sheets, we have given different colors. Now, which color will be applied to that particular text? We need to understand that. So here we are saying that if the internal style is defined after the link tag, then the elements will be formatted with orange color. Otherwise, they will be formatted with the navy color. In order to understand this practical better, the working of multiple style sheets, we are going to use these two documents. Here you can see there is variation in colors. So let's proceed with the first document, this one. And we need to check the source code that we are using for this document, actually both the documents. So one by one, you can click on the page source for both of the documents. Now for this document, this is the source code. And here you can see that we are using the style tag where we have given the formatting options after the link tag. So the output is that the color should be orange. So here you can see the color is orange. Likewise, in the second example, in this example, this is the code that we are working upon. And in order to compare this code with this one, what you can see is the style tag is used before the link tag. So whatever color we have provided inside the link tag, that will be applicable. Now inside this link tag, we are using the CSS document. And in order to access that CSS document, we will go to the location we have where we have saved it. So here at the bottom, you can see that mystyle.css document is there. We need to check the code, so we will open it with the text editing software. I'm using Notepad++ here. Now here you can see that we have given for the heading tag, the color should be navy. And so accordingly, the output is showing the navy color here for this particular heading. So for this multiple style sheet options, we need to remember that when we are providing colors using external style sheet also and internal style sheet also whichever is coming last like here style is coming afterwards so this color will be applied to this heading similarly in this scenario the link option that means the external style sheet is coming later on so this color will be applied to this particular 